What's up guys, today I'm going to show you how to make outros like Purgify. Alright, let's get right into it. Okay, so I already dragged in my logo animation and you can do that too with your logo. Then at the end I'm just going to zoom it out really quick, so I'll press S, keyframe it, and then at the end I'm going to put it at 0. Then select them both, press F9, and then go to the graph editor. Then right click and make sure it's on value graph, and now you can just make this type of graph. Alright, so now we'll add the lens flare, so we'll just create a solid layer. You can hold Ctrl plus Y, or you can go to here, right click, new, and then solid. And then we'll call it lens flare, and then just press OK. Now we'll cut it to the length, so go to the end, Ctrl, Shift plus D, and then delete the rest. Okay, so now there's a few options to add a lens flare. The first one is just an effect called lens flare. And yeah, I think there are three options, as you can see here, and they're pretty good, but obviously there's not a lot of customization. All right, then the next thing is a plugin called Optical Flares, and this is a plugin that's paid, so um, you will need to install it if you don't have it yet. And this is the one Purgify uses. And then the last option is to go to my Lens Flares tutorial, and I'll just link it somewhere in case you want to know how to make Lens Flares completely from scratch. All right, so we'll be using Optical Flares, and the first thing we're going to do is click on Options. Then I'll quickly go to a flare that Purgify used once, so it's in Motion Graphics, and then this one here. But you can use any flare, to be honest. And then here you got all these settings, so maybe we want it more like a greenish color. And then you can just press OK. All right, then you can go to this last setting here and set it to on transparent. And this will make sure that your logo will be visible. What you can also do is put this logo layer above and then set it to screen. And this will make sure our logo is on top of our lens flare. So the glows of our lens flare will not affect our logo. But for now, I think I'll just put it below it. So we'll put it to normal again. Then you want to go to the beginning and then make a keyframe here. And then just put your lens flare somewhere around here. So let's drag it to the top and then a little bit more to the left. Then you can go to the last frame. And then you can just drag this first value here to the right. All right, now make sure your layer is selected and then press U. Then select all the keyframes, press F9, go to the graph editor here. And then you want to right click and make sure you're in speed graph. All right, the last step is to select this keyframe here and then hold shift and drag it to the left. And then this handle, you want to drag it to the left as well. And now, as you can see, our lens flare will first go fast and then slow. All right, and if you want to change the lens flare, you can go to options again, and then just choose a different one, like this one, for example, and then OK. And as you can see, it changed. All right, so this is how you make outros like Purgify. Hopefully you've learned a lot, and if you did, make sure to subscribe. And if you want me to help you even more with After Effects, then make sure to go to the first link in the description down below. Alright, bye bye.